Hi friends, welcome to Geeks for Geeks. This is a video tutorial on how to count the substrings with each character occurring at most k times. Let's have a look at the problem statement. Given a string s, count the number of substrings in which each character occurs at most k times. Assume that the string consists of only lowercase English alphabets. For example, for input string ab, k equal to 1, output is 3 as all the substrings a, b, a, b have the individual character count less than 1. For input string a, 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 b, b, k equal to 2, output will be 12, as substrings that have individual character count at most 2 are a, 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 the individual a's, b, b, a, 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 b, 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 a, a, b, a, b, b, a, a, b, b. Let's look at the algorithm. A simple solution is to first find all the substrings and then check if the count of each character is at most k in each, in each substring. The time complexity of this solution is order n cube. An efficient solution is to maintain the starting point and ending point of the substrings. Let us fix the starting point to an index i. Keep incrementing the ending point j one at a time. When changing the ending point, update the count of the corresponding character. Then check for this substring, that whether each character has count at most k or not. If yes, then increment the answer by 1, else increment the starting point and reset the ending point. The starting point is incremented because during the last update on the ending point, character count exceed k and it will only increase further. So no subsequent substring will have with the given fixed starting point will uh, will be a substring with each character count at most k. Now let's look at the implementation. We get a string s and k as input. Initialize answer as 0. Create an integer count array to store the count of each character. Now traverse the string s. Set the character count as 0 that is count of each character is 0. Now we will find the substring starting from i. Increment the character count of current character by count of s or j minus a plus plus. Check if the count of the character is less than k. If yes, that means this is a valid substring and we increment answer. Else, we break the loop as subsequent substrings from this starting point will also have count greater than k and hence are invalid substrings. Finally, Return the value of answer. The time complexity of this solution is order n square. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Please leave us your likes and comments.